SR93 Boxing back with another quick video. Manny Pacquiao has admitted himself to be a dope head. He mentioned uh, recently that he agree, like he did all kinds of drugs, all kinds of different drugs. Uh, I think this before he became a champion, which is crazy because like um, we look at Floyd Mayweather, we bash him for his past. We bash a whole bunch of people for their past. But you know, when it comes to Manny Pacquiao, um, I, he's not, he doesn't seem to get the same hate. Manny Pacquiao has always, is always su also um, rather supporting the Filipino president. Can't remember his name. But the Filipino president has this really, really, and I, I don't want to be too political here, but he's really harsh on drug crimes, especially people on drugs. Now, I do believe that they're committing some sort of genocide against people that has these type of drugs, even like, it could be like weed and shit. The crazy thing is for Manny Pacquiao to support a guy like this who's committing genocide, technically, in my opinion, that's genocide. If you look at the quick research, a lot of these people that were killed, I think, like, the unknown, wait, let me let me read this shit, just, just give me a second here, yeah. let, me, let me read this shit, let me read out. Um, fuck, let me, let me stop the video quick and I'll... Yeah, it says, uh, According to police, 3,171 drug dealers and users have been killed, two-thirds by unknown asylums and the rest in police operation. So, one-third has been killed, uh, one-third is basically over a thousand here, roughly a thousand, killed by the police operation. I mean, look, if they're serious drug dealers or whatever, then yeah, but I... It goes two-thirds by unknown assailants. Like, they, they... What the fuck? So, that's crazy, man. That's crazy. For Manny Packer to go out and support this guy, he... You know, people are saying he's a piece of shit. Some people are saying that, well, he is a piece of shit. Manny Packer... You know, if you look, ask me five years before, six, seven, eight years before, I didn't know too much about Manny Pacquiao's background, and you, I was a bit naive, and I thought Manny Pacquiao was a great person, and you know, he might be an okay person in terms of when you meet him and whatnot, but he says some crazy shit that make you question him as a character. Like, I don't, I'm not gay. I have my opinions on like homosexuality and stuff like that, but. I would never compare gay people with animals, they're still people, just because you have an opinion that's different to theirs doesn't make them any less of a human being than you are. Not only are you fucked up, but you're like you're big headed, fucked up, and I don't even know what to say man, that's crazy, like that's a crazy thing to say. He's been saying all kinds of crazy things, and now, I, you know what, Manny Pacquiao's been like losing fans ever since he fought Floyd, and he's been making a shoulder injury. Then he's be talking shit about gay people like that. And you know, some keep in mind there were some people that had a note of his past, you know, he was beating women, drinking, all that kinds of shit. He has those past and I think he admits to a lot of them. But you know, he still continues to do some crazy shit. I mean look at him. So now he's already been losing fans. He lost the Nike that thing by saying talking shit about gay people. And now I feel he's putting, when it comes to his death of his career, he's putting the cherry on the top. I really did not want, I didn't really bother about the Manny Pacquiao versus Jesse Vargas fight. Because, I mean, I know it's going to be a competitive fight, but I didn't really want to see Pacquiao. I mean, he's going to be like a, he could have put, picked a better fighter, but Jesse Vargas is a decent fighter. Now I'm looking forward to it, hoping that Jesse Vargas wins. Really hope he wins, man. Because that's some piece of shit movement. Like, you... He could have killed this... Like, he's supporting a government that's killing all bunch of shit. Like, unknown silence. Like, what the fuck does that even mean? Un well, like, undercover people from the government. So, yeah, he's technically, in my opinion, supporting genocide. The West isn't doing much. The West only does shit when... It benefits them. Syria. Iraq. Things like that. So, yeah, man. That's what I think for Manny Pack is a piece of shit. I am rooting against him. He's still a good fighter, but that doesn't take away from the fact that he's a piece of shit. I'm out.